Well, Tennis, let's just start out with your, your last fight, a big win for you. How important was that victory to kind of just snap a, that losing streak and get some momentum going? In, uh, in the UFC and in the sport, man, you lose 3-4 and see you later, you know? So it was important that I, like, uh, kind of reset myself and, like, all right, let me do what I do. I don't worry about, you know, losing, you know? Um, so now, now you're going to see the, the, old, the old menace is back. What do you think the difference was? I mean, did you feel like you were holding yourself back a little bit? In that last fight? Um, I just played it cautious. You know, I was talking to DC in an interview uh, last night. He's like, been there, dude. Been there, done that, got the t-shirt. It's, it's part of being a champion. Nice. In the meantime, you set a world record for lemon juice consumption. Uh, are you getting some crazy ideas here? Are you going for any more world records? Or was this a, this a one-time thing? This is the second time I've, at, I've been asked if I was going for more records. I'm going to do some research, and I'm going to have something. Probably before next flight, we'll figure something out, because I am a competitor. I'm going to figure it out, and I'm going to win. Um, but yeah, we, uh, we put that on my YouTube page, Menace Tube, my Guinness Book of World Records. You know, So we're trying to take... We're not only trying to get a UFC belt, trying to take over the internet as well. Nice. Sporting some nice uh, fangs there today. Is that part of a new look for you? Um, well, I was my last fight. I wore fangs during um, back when I wrestled in college, um, back in the, the tough days. Um, and then I've got a superstition that if I lose in a mouthpiece, I can't wear that mouthpiece again. So this is a new one, and it's back. Very nice. Well, let's talk about Honey J. Sums. He's coming off the suspension. Uh, you know, did have some momentum behind him as well, some mixed results. What do you think about him as an opponent? Um, definitely a worldly opponent. You know, he won the Ultimate Fighter Brazil. The guy's super tough. Um, he's always looking for highlight reel fights. He's got knockouts. He's got submissions. And uh, the guy's a goer, but I think I'm on a different tier than him. Before you had the losses, I mean, you did have quite a bit of momentum going. So is the goal to, to get back there? Do you feel like you can get right back into the title discussion again, or is it going to take a while to build back? Uh, I've been asked that a few times as well, and um, I'm not worried about a streak and stuff like that. I'm worried about winning and the next win, you know. So right now my the task at hand is beating uh, Honey Jason, you know. So after that we'll, we'll put our target on the next guy. Um, but, yeah, I think after beating uh, Honey Jason, a top three, top five guy, a win over him puts him right there for a title shot. You mentioned his exciting style combined with your exciting style. It looks like it could be one of those Friday night type battles. Is that what you're expecting on, on Saturday night? Um, I will be prepared for it, but I'm not expecting it. I'm looking for a lopsided fight. I'm looking more for the performance of the night bonus.